In this video, we'll cover how to connect the TMX100 Thermalink's Wi-Fi module to a Wi-Fi network using an Apple device. The TMX100 is only compatible with the Zone 550 and the Snow 550 version 2.0. The first step is to download the Thermalink's app from the App Store. If users already have the app, please make sure you have the latest software update. The next step is to press and hold the reset button, which is located on the left side of the TMX100, for 10 seconds. All LED lights will go blank for a quick second. The red Wi-Fi LED light will start to flash, letting you know that the unit is ready to be connected to the Wi-Fi. At this time, unplug the TMX100 for 10 seconds, then plug it back in. On your Apple device, open your Wi-Fi settings and search for the Thermalinks network. Take note of the four-digit Thermalinks number at this time. If this is an older version of the unit, there will be no four-digit number. If you're trying to set up the Wi-Fi from a previously failed attempt, please forget the Thermalinks network in your Wi-Fi settings. Next step is to open the Thermalinks app and select Wi-Fi setup. Please input the four-digit Thermalinks number that you noted when selecting the Thermalinks network in the top line. Do not input anything for TLBTU. In Network SSID, please enter your network name that you're connecting to, ensuring that it does not exceed 24 characters. It is also case sensitive and cannot have any special characters in the name. Please make sure that your Wi-Fi network that you're connecting to is a 2.4 GHz, as the Thermalinks is only compatible with the 2.4. If you're not familiar with your Wi-Fi network frequency, please contact your Wi-Fi provider. In Password, please enter your network SSID password. Again, case sensitive with no special characters. Once you have completed this, select Device Setup. The app will send the SSID and the password. It will inform you if they have been accepted and then a 120 second timer will begin to establish a network connection. After the timer is finished, all three LED lights on the TMX100 will be solid. This means that the connection process was successful. If the LED lights are not all solid, please unplug the TMX100 for 10 seconds and then plug it back in. Wait to see if all three lights have become solid. If only the red and green lights are solid, then you need to open port 1314 on your router to allow the Thermalinks to communicate with our server. If you need assistance with this, please contact your internet provider. If at this time only the green LED light is solid, this means you have inputted the incorrect password for the Wi-Fi network that you have selected. If the connection was not made, please select the Wi-Fi setup button on the Thermalinks app and press email log. This will compile information about your connection process that can be sent to HPX tech support for troubleshooting. Please note that if you exit the app during the connection process, all information about your connection process will be deleted and HPX tech support will receive no information.